reports mail lit house on fire with gas. Mission. RP spilled gas and it sparked the fire. Uh, generator started it when he spilled the gas. RP is hysterical. Generator is in the garage, so we'll probably have a garage fire, guys. All right. RP is calling from the house just south. Flames very close to her house. Look at it. Somebody from the line. Yeah. Actually, hey guys, what? let's let's handjack this. I got okay. that. I got that. You okay. want to pull up? Yeah, we can. Hold on. 121 North Kachina. We have a Yeah. Oh, okay. We pull up to the left here. To the south. East deputy is going to be Kachina Command. Command post is going to be to the west. Guys, I want us Alpha to side. help her hand check yeah. this quick. We're I got that. It. Are we pulling into 210? Yeah. Okay. We'll see if we can get off and just couple alarm. Did you get a report as far as the uh, occupant? Alarm copies. We have East of the Unseen, heavily involved house fire explosion south. East of the command, command will be to the west, off the side, defensive, working for touch. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
Go ahead, immediately pull a second line of hand, pull one. <laughs> They got hydrant. I want to one something with hydrant right now. Okay, we're gonna go in this right yeah, side. Let's see. We're searching this right apartment. Hello, we're right here. Hey. Trying to figure out if someone's inside. I just spoke to some neighbors. Uh, they're not sure if everyone's out or not. Anybody out here? Oh, hey, three. The right side of the is clear. And that's clear. Well, I'll call you a temple. Did you hear that, Chief? They just did a search. Huh? Uh, they said this one was clear. All clear. All clear. Entering the left apartment. Bravo apartment. Anybody out here? I'm in the kitchen right now. Yeah. Nothing? Okay. We're paying for the engine one. Go ahead. Primary stage clear on both upstairs apartments. There's a lot of fire up there. So we get getting another hose up here? Where's the line at? Go, go. Get that fire real quick. All right, y'all go ahead and uh, start helping with the tax. Oh! Walk in, it's all coming out. Yeah. I go in and pull some stuff. Yeah. Now we're hitting it. Oh, get that way, boys, get that way. We're good. Okay. Change your bottle out. They're making good headway on that upstairs in the attic. Just about got it all knocked out. I don't think there's anybody in there. Uh, oh, everybody's accounted for. Everybody's accounted for, okay. So we've got a call uh, reported a structure fire. There was supposed to be a victim inside. Got on scene, did a, a search of both apartments. Didn't find any, any persons. Everybody got out. Uh, knocked down the fire and we're all good. So it's, everybody's safe. So the report from the uh, first unit is they have heavy fire. They're gonna be doing a 360 view of the uh, fire. And uh, continue all units. We're getting heavy fire and press the clock That's a problem. Okay, go ahead, go ahead. Okay. Go ahead, check it out. We're first framing that. First frame. Good. Move on, man. It looks like we have a running attic fire. We have fire established in multiple sections within the house, so they're calling for additional lines so that it can get a sufficient amount of water to meet the amount of fire that exists up in the attic. It's 
It's all sealed up tight in here. It's all plywooded over everywhere. Yeah. There possibly could be a grow house with the, uh, the plywood, the uh, insulation. It was just a lot of fire, and it was in every room that we came to. So everything's looking uh, knocked down right now. Fire is under control. All crews are accounted for. Um, coming out this time of the night, it's uh, always surprising, right? When you think you're going to have a nice, quiet night, and it, something like this happens. So. <laughs> Working fire. Working fire. heavy smoke showing from the roof. Well, that's all I can see is from the roof, but there's good smoke pushing. Someone's got to take control of the elevator. We're going up this way. Chief! Go down the other stairs. Go down the other stairs. Get out of the building. It's on fire. Go that way. Let's go, man. It's not a drill, OK? Fire. What apartment is it in? What apartment? <laughs> huh? M. On? 14 Michael. 14 Michael. Where is the M apartment? 14 M. I know, but I want to see exactly it's where it right is. It's in the middle. Martin! Right this way. Yeah, the fire is one floor above. Do not go any higher. Come on, let's go. This is the fire department. We're going to come out and make a left. Fire. All right, where, where's storage? Up that line up, man. Yeah, let's go. All right, let's go. Yeah, let's go. Right there, to the right, though. No, to the left. He said to the left. All right, just let me know. Let me know. We need more pressure down that line. They're hooking it up. They're hooking it up. up on the 14th floor. We have a full third alarm in, so we have seven engines, three ladders, rescue truck, a rack unit. And right now they're searching all the floors. They are ventilating the bulkhead doors and making sure that they're getting all the smoke out. No injuries reported and uh, nobody's uh, missing. Thank you. What do you got over there? All clear. All clear. You can see by the ceiling the amount of heat that came out of the fire apartment. The company's made a real good knockdown on the fire. Checking for extension. There's no fire extension to the floor above. No other civilian injuries. And we kept the fire to the uh, area of origin. Hey, guys. I'm Matt Eisman from Live Rescue. Subscribe to A&E for more videos and catch full episodes on AETV.com.